Grandpa's gone. I'm so lonely. Whoa. Whoa. Why is... Hey, Stacy. I give you permission. When I feel like you can call me, then I tell you to call me. <sighs> anyway. Hi, Tanya. How are you? This is Liz. I'm fine, but I'm bored silly. Huh? Wrong number. Oops. Sorry. What a dumb bitch. <laughs> uh, this is what happens when you don't go to school, kids. You need to go to school and get good grades. That way you don't call people on the wrong number thinking they're somebody else. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's more to it than that, but yeah. Go to school, kids. Oh, my God. Why do you keep calling me? Hi, Tanya. How are you? This is Liz. I'm fine, but bored silly. Huh? Wrong number. Oh, sorry. <sighs> I hate this bitch. I hate her. I absolutely hate her. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Whoops. What's up, everybody? It's Diesel here once again, bringing you the fifth episode of the Pokemon Crystal Randomized Nuzlocke. On the last episode, we journeyed through... A little bit of the ruins of Alf, but I decided not to go through it because I thought it would take too much time to actually go through the entire thing, and there's really nothing there other than the unknown, which is probably going to be randomized to other Pokemon, so I didn't think it'd be worth my time. I thought it'd just be a waste of time, waste of space as far as recording goes, so here we are, and I believe this is, where the fuck are we, the Union Cave, I think this is called, yeah, the Union Cave, okay. So we're going to get through here, we're going to get to Route 33, which is not the same as Route 32, obviously. <laughs> Just making sure. And then we're going to hit Azalea Town, and we're going to fight Buggy. I think his name is Buggy, or her. God, it's been so long since I played this game. On top of that, it's been a long time since I watched the Johto Journeys on TV, or in this case, on DVD and or on Netflix. I don't even know if that shit's on Netflix. I doubt it. But if it is, I'm probably watching that shit whenever I get my internet back. But... Without further ado, I'm rambling. Let's check out the Twisted Team, because, you know, that's what everybody wants to see, for, especially for all of you new people who haven't watched any of my videos yet. Let's get caught up on that. Starting off the list, it's Karama, the motherfucking... What is it? What is he? What is he? Vulpix, that's what it is. Couldn't even remember what he was called. Yep, we got Karama. Fire, playing fire tight, knows Ember, Tail Whip, and Quick Attack. And actually, not pretty bad on the uh, stat-wise there. It's got pretty decent. Okay, well, uh, sorry. I got sidetracked. We got Dobbs, the ferret. The ferret! He's no scratch. Defense curl, quick attack. And if you guys are wondering, who the fuck, why is he named Dobbs? Well, that's another YouTuber that is on, well, YouTube. And he does the randomized Nuzlocke as well. And he likes ferrets for some reason. And I couldn't think of a name for ferret. So Dobbs. If you're watching this, fur it. Just throwing that out there. Anyways, got third in line. He's kind of a fan favorite, I hear. Randy of the fourth, I'm a joke. Look at them, look at them. Biceps and them and them chestuses. And like I'm getting a little jealous over here, making me feel like inadequate. I need to work out. I think I need to work out. I need to go to the gym. I need to look that good. Anyways, he knows low kick, leer, and focus energy. Almost had focus punch again. Fourth in line, we got Reaper. I'm going to just call him Reaper. Fuck that S. That last S, it doesn't exist. The S is silent, guys. His name is Reaper. <laughs> He's a bug flying type. He knows quick attack, leader, focus energy, and pursuit. He needs to hurry up and learn slash, or I need to get the HM for cut, because I just, I don't feel right. Just quick attack, quick attack, quick attack. It doesn't feel right. Last but not least, as far as having playable Pokemon. Fifth in line. <laughs> Patrick the Star. The Star Me. It's a water psychic type and we got Bubble Beam, Rapid Spin, Recover, and Tackle. I love the fact that we got Recover guys. I'm not even gonna lie. I don't even have to use potions on his ass. And then we got the Mysterious Egg 
Oh my god. That Professor Elm had given us. And let's check on it, actually. I don't think I even checked on it last episode, which is pretty funny. Wonder what's inside. It needs more time, though. So we haven't even made a dent in this. We might have the one that's going to last all freaking series long, which is going to suck. Because that means we don't get to have a six Pokemon. We only get five. Although we do get one revive if we do lose all of our Pokemon, meaning we can get one of the Pokemon that we lost during the last battle. For instance, let's say we go into battle and we lose all five of our Pokemon because obviously we can't send in an egg if the game won't let us. I will be able to revive one of these five. And that's it. I can't, if I was a dead Pokemon in the PC, I cannot revive that one is what I'm saying. Only the ones with, that are go into battle with me during the last battle. But yes, let's go ahead without further ado. I'm probably fucking procrastinating at this point and rambling on. Let's get through this stupid cave because I hate caves. Great when you first walk in because, well, this right here. And I know this is probably going to be a ho oh right? No, it's Eradicate. Yeah, I, I ran into a ho oh last episode, guys. And I'm a little upset because I got to catch him. He only needs Sacred Fire, and it only can be used, like, five to ten times. I can't remember how many times he can actually use it, but that's the only move he knew. It was level six or some shit. And it sucked, because after you use all of your moves, you can only use Struggle, and then it just deteriorated his life, and, yeah, it was terrible. Very, very bad. Bad for business. I hope I'm going the right way. I don't even remember what direction I was even going. Oh, the slow bro. What's up, bro? What's up, bros? My name is Peter Pat. <laughs> I wonder if I can get copy strike, copyright strike for that. Probably not, but I hope not. <laughs> I'm sorry, PewDiePie. I'm sorry. <laughs> Zubat Supersonic keeps confusing my Pokemon. I'm seriously upset about that. Well, I'm seriously don't give a shit. Maybe you should be better at, you know... Being a Pokemon trainer and not being a damn cave full of Zubats. He's got a swine up. I think I got Vulpix, right? We got Karama? Yeah. I think it's still a ground type, but I don't think he knows any ground type moves to start out with. I think you gotta teach it to him. I'm not sure. I'm not entirely sure. I never had a swine up or a pillow swine on my team ever, period, in my entire life. What is with everybody with Wobbuffets? I don't like Wobbuffets. They're kind of douchebags. Ugh. He's just gonna use counter and fucking mirror coat. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I don't wanna deal with it. Told you. Thank God I didn't use an actual move, though. I'm gonna use Leer. So he will. I don't think he can still do that. He can't copy that, can he? I don't think so. We're just gonna keep using Leer. We're gonna keep. We're gonna play it smart. We're gonna waste as many, much of his PP while we lower his defense, and then we're just gonna fucking all-out attack his ass. Let's see you fucking counter me now, bitch. I don't know how many times I can actually lower. I think it's like five or six times. I know it's going to take a lot of time to do it, but it'll be worth it. Because I know if he hits me with a, a counter or... Yeah, it's going to have to be counter because I don't think mirror, I don't think he can copy if it's Mirror Coat. It has to be a special move for Mirror Coat, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. But now, one hit KO. <laughs> Guaranteed. Nice. He's freaking attack is high as shit now. I'm flamed out. You didn't even have a fire Pokemon, bro. Like, what? Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. I really wish I would have brought repels. I didn't even do any training outside of... Uh, oh! It's, a, it's an Umbreon. It's my favorite. It's my favorite. It's my favorite evolution. Other than Jolteon. Oh. I can't, I, can't, I can't believe I gotta run. I'm sorry. I can't even catch it. Why did I? Why can't I have run into you instead of fucking Ho-Oh? 
I mean, it would have been nice to have the ho -Oh, but still. Ooh, a far-fetched. Still can't catch you either, bro. I mean, I could be, like, training right now, but... Uh, eh, I just wanted to get out of this place. Let me out. I'm locked up. <laughs> won't let me out. Leave a comment down below if you know what song that is and who is the artist of that song. Oh, there's the exit. But I see an item. We're going to go over there and get that. I'm going to go grab that Master Ball real quick. Um, take a sip of my drink while this game decides to tell me. Ooh, the Vile Plume. I'm getting excited for a lot of these different Pokemon because I, I just really wish I can catch one. I want to catch one. I mean, we can get one as soon as we leave the freaking... Oh, hello. I thought I turned my phone down. I guess I lied to myself. Way to go. Way to go, Diesel. Let's go ahead and turn that all the way down. Just in case. Because Twitter likes to yell at me a lot. Which, by the way, thank you. Thank you, thank you, guys. All of you guys who have been showing me all of the freaking positive support. Both on Twitter and on YouTube. Especially, especially on episode three. Yeah, episode three. Oh my god, if you guys go back, it's like over 50, 51, 52 views as of the making of this video right this second. But yes, like, oh my god, guys, I can't believe how much you guys came through and just retweeted and shared it and just a lot of people watched it and I got no dislikes on it so far, so you guys are liking it. And it's just, oh my god, it's awesome. It's such an awesome feeling. I just wanted to take a second to thank you guys. Screw this guy that's talking to me right now. I don't even care. But I just wanted to thank you guys. Like, that makes me feel really good. It means I'm doing something right. I don't know what it is, but it's I'm doing something right. <laughs> Anyways. If it's light, a cave isn't scary. If you're strong, Pokemon aren't scary. I beg to differ. I bet if a Haunter or a Ghastly or a Gengar came out of nowhere, you'd be like, ah, and just run away. That was the most terrible sc little girl scream I could possibly do. And he's going to start off things with a... F oh, okay. All right. You think you're all big and bad. I knew it. I just fucking knew he was going to do that. Because that's probably the only move he knows how to do. But that's okay. We're just going to light his little tiny ass on fire. And I knew that wasn't going to work. Hey. Hey. Stop it. Bad bug. Bad. My dog's like looking up at me like, I didn't do anything. I'm not talking to you, buddy. You're okay. You're okay, buddy. You're all right. Anyways, he's down. Karama's going to grow up to be level 13. And he's going to learn Roar. Actually, that's a pretty useful move. It's uh, Especially if we come across something that we can't fight. Like, for instance, let's say like a Squirtle or a, you know, Totodile. Or just something that we can't really fight. And use Roar, get the next Pokemon out. And it's also good for... Why did I even go this way? It's also good for wild encounters, and you're just like, ah, I don't want to fight you. Like, for instance, I'm about to show you, I think it works for wild encounters. I know that's what it was used for in Gen 1, so I wouldn't see why it wouldn't work for this. And please don't kill me. That is a very powerful move. Please don't kill me. Thank you. God, thank you. Yep, it works. Bye-bye. Bye, Ho-Oh. -bye. Bye, ho, -Oh. ho -Oh fled in fear. <laughs> That's how you know my Pokemon are the best. Route 33. Nice. Hello. Hello, little girly. <gasps> I finally got through that cave. It was much bigger than I expected. I got too tired to explore the whole thing. So I came outside. Well... It's all good, you know, maybe take some soda pop or some lemonade with you. Alright, the fruit tree, we're gonna get a poison cure berry. That'll definitely come in handy. And, uh, I also just got proven something by getting hit with that sacred fire by Ho-Oh. It's supposed to burn the opposing Pokemon no matter what. But since Karama is a fire type, she did not become burned. So that proved my, uh, I think it was last episode or the episode before, but I think it was last episode. Where I asked if, uh, fire types can be burned. But I don't think so. Because he just got hit with a move where it guarantees a burn. And it did not burn. If anything, it better did shit. Why am I not... There we go. Alright, come on. 
Come on, something good. Something good. Big money. Oh. oh. That's actually kind of upsetting. <laughs> it's cute, but not what I was looking for. I was looking for something a little bit more powerful to start. But, ah, uh, fuck it. Uh, we'll catch it. We'll catch it. I'll try to catch it. Don't kill it. Don't kill it. Okay, good. Good job, Karama. You know better. You know better. I'm going to hit it with one more quick attack, and that should be more than enough then to, uh... Never mind. We're just going to fucking... We're going to just obliterate it. Fuck you, Karama. I should have released your ass. I should just, you know, get out of here. I should release you. But it's whatever. I didn't even want that Pokemon, to be honest with you guys. So it's not that big of a deal, but it's just... Would have been nice to have. Just in case we lose a Mon later on down the road. Because I don't even think we have any Mons in the PC. And I didn't read any of that. But that's fine. We're just going to fight them. We're rebels today. So now Eevee. Oh, I want an Eevee. I got plenty of stones. Want to trade? I'll trade you in an egg. That'll take forever to hatch. But that's fine. It's cool. We're going to use Roar, because I don't want to fight the Eevee. Not with Karama, anyway. See what else he's got. There we go. I can fucks with that now. We can light that bitch on fire easily. Boom. Fine. That's cool. That's fine. That's fine. It's cool. Because it's not going to do much. But I'm not going to take no chances, just in case this douchebag decides to crit me. We use a potion. Get up a little bit more health. Oh no! What does this do? Is this actually an attacking move? Yes, it is. And it does six damage. Okay. All right. I'm just gonna burn you one petal at a time then. I wonder if this move continues to keep going, or not. I don't know. I don't know how this game works. <laughs> it's been a minute and a half since I played this game. Just like Pokemon Red, this is probably about just as long since I played this one. I think the most recent game that I've played that's not on my 3DS, like on an emulator or whatever, was Pokemon Emerald. So I think I could probably play that no problem. Alright, we're going to bring out Randy the 4th since he's bringing out Eevee, normal type. Randy can freaking just kick this bitch right in the face. Pop. <laughs> come on, I dare you live from that. I was about to say, come on. It's Randy. Nobody can. Oh. <laughs> now, now not only can we kick you, now we can just freaking full on. Boom. Chop you. Whoa! You've got more zip than me! Goddamn right. Shit, I bet freaking Randy taller and bigger than you. Let's look at let's look and see if uh karate chop is actually oh it's not gonna tell me, is it? Nope. It is not. I was gonna see if it was actually a fighting move, but I guess we'll find out when we go into our next battle and I use Randy again. But let's go ahead and move on. I think Azalea Town's right here. Yep. Oh, that's right. We got to go down there eventually. But Team Rocket's down there right now. What's up, old man? The Slowpoke have disappeared from town. I hear the tales are being sold somewhere. Well, that sounds very unfortunate. Who would do such a thing? There's no great balls here. Pokeballs will have to do. I wish Kurt could make me some of his custom balls. Well, I guess Kurt has really great balls. I can't wait to uh, partake in his balls. I'm trying very hard not to laugh. Whoa, we are not going to buy 10. I didn't realize how much that was. We're going to buy five of them. Get a couple more potions, like three. Will be enough, I guess. No, 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 no. What the hell does charcoal do? Powers up fire type. Why would you put that there to fucking taunt me? I would totally buy that if I had the money. Wait a second. Speaking of having that money, let's get rid of that silver leaf. How much is that? Oh. That's it. Just 500? 
All right, fuck you. I guess I can fucking do five hundred dollars. I guess. Screw it. Screw it. Give me the twenty-five for the mail. I'm not gonna need that. That's a waste of my freaking time. Music mail. Oh no 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 no. What? Yes. Brick piece, a rare chunk of tile. What the fuck does that do? I don't... What? A rare chunk of tile. I don't get... What? What does it do, though? Can I sell it? I guess we're about to find out. I can, but he's only going to give me 25 bucks for it. If it's a rare piece of tile... I'm keeping that. Uh-uh. You ain't gonna give me no twenty-five dollars. Uh-uh. You trying to screw me over? We're going to the Pokemon Center. Freaking poor Patrick over here is burned still. That's why I haven't used him because he he went head first into a ho-ho and he survived, but severely severely wounded. So I need the good old Nurse Joy to just fill up all my balls like she always does. She's got the greatest hands. So soft. She must use like. The finest of lotions. Thanks, Nurse Joy. You're always so good to me. All right. And, oh, we can't even go inside the gym. Because Team Rocket's a douche nugget. Cut through Azalea and you'll be in Elix Forest. But these skinny trees make it impossible to get through. The Charcoal Man's Pokemon can cut down trees. Well, where's the Charcoal Man? Is this the house? I guess so, because it has charcoal in the name. Charcoal Man! Hey! Hey, bro, listen. I hear you got cut. Oh, the Slowpoke have disappeared from the town. The forest protector may be angry with us. It may be a bad omen. We should stay in. Okay. Alrighty then. That's not what I came here for, buddy. Where have all the Slowpoke gone? Are they out playing somewhere? What the fuck, over? I just want cut. I guess we can't get it yet. I guess uh, we might have to go to Kurt first. Because I know he's going to probably run to the the well. And, uh, yeah. Let's go in here first. But first, let's just, I just saw that. I just saw that. Let's do this first. Give me that. Thank you, sir. Or ma'am. Whatever this freaking plant's gender may or may not be. Mr. Kurt. Hmm? Who are you? Any guy? You want me to make some bows? Sorry, but that'll have to wait. Do you know Team Rocket? Ah, don't worry. I'll tell you anyhow. Team Rocket's an evil gang that uses Pokemon for their dirty work. They're supposed to have been disbanded three years ago. Anyway, they're at the well. Cutting off Slowpoke tails for sale! So I'm going to go give them. A lesson in vain. Hang on, Slowpoke. Old Kurt is on his way. Why is everybody in this town Japanese? Ah, that's right. This is a Japanese game. That makes sense. Makes sense. Grandpa's gone. I'm so lonely. Whoa. Whoa. Why is... Hey, Stacy. I give you permission. When I feel like you can call me, then I tell you to call me. Ah. <sighs> Anyway. Hi, Tanya. How are you? This is Liz. I'm fine, but I'm bored silly. Huh? Wrong number. Oops. Sorry. What a dumb bitch. <laughs> uh, this is what happens when you don't go to school, kids. You need to go to school and get good grades. That way you don't call people on the wrong number thinking they're somebody else. Mm-hmm. I mean, there's more to it than that, but yeah. Go to school, kids. Anyways, let's move on to the slowpoke well thingy majiggy, I guess. Which is funny, because I doubt there's going to be any slowpoke in here. Now, if there's a slowpoke in here, that would be the real miracle. Oh, shit. Oh, 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 Kurt. Hey, buddy. Why? You're not, you're not off to the rescue. Why are you not off to the rescue? Hey there, Erica! The guard up top took off when I shouted at him, but then I took a tumble down the well. 
I slammed down hard on my back so that I can't move. Rats! If I were fit, my Pokemon would have punished them. But it can't be helped. Erica, show them how gutsy you are in my place. Sure, I guess, but uh, what can I do? I'm just a, I'm just a, I'm just a child. I'm just a little girl. And a, ooh, this is a new place, guys. Remember, new place, new Pokemon, new encounter. Now we can get ourselves a Graveler, which will be very, very, very useful. Just how am I going to go about catching him? Hmm. This is going to be interesting. Very interesting. Indeed. We're going to switch to Dobbs. He's like, you know, a furret. So we're going to totally use Dobbs. Yeah, that's why I wanted to switch. Fuck. Don't do it. Dude. Okay. Six damage. We can, we can fucks with that. Because I can fucks with more than that. We're going to use Defense Curl a couple of times. Oh! Okay, new plan. Attack! <laughs> yeah, if he's going to keep spamming that, we're in trouble. We're going to have to fucking hit him hard as we can now. Because... Fuck my life, that's why. I need a crit now. That's what I need. Otherwise, we're going to be here all day, and I ain't got time. To be here all day. Alright, he's not going to do too much damage to me now. That's good. But we need him to go... I need that HP to go down. I need it to go way down. Not all the way down. Dobbs, listen. Remember what happened last episode? You'd be freaking killing things a little too easy sometimes. You get too, too far ahead of yourself. So I'm going to go ahead and throw a Pokeball now, just in case. Because, you know, he gets too carried away. One. Two. Fuck you. <laughs> Alright. We're going to hit him one or two more times. And then throw another Pokeball. Because I don't want to waste all my Pokeballs. It's expensive shit. Take another drink right quick. Drinking on some Dr. Pepper again, guys. In the bottle this time, not even in the can. It's delicious. I love it. It's delicious. Uh, let's take our chances again. Let's roll the dice. Come on, seven. Got him! Ha <laughs> We got a graveler. We got a graveler. It travels by rolling on mountain paths. If it gains too much speed, it stops by running into huge rocks. That sounds painful as shit. So, what are we going to call this guy? Hmm. Very interesting question. A big boulder with hands. And then he evolves in the golem, which is a big ball of rock. Like a big smoother ball of rock with arms and legs. What do we call a rock? <laughs> hmm. I said, hmm. Seriously, hmm. Everybody's probably thinking into themselves, why did I call him Rocky? Really? Rocky? That's like thinking even a cat Fluffy. Or a dog Poochie. Hmm. A rock with hands. This should not be that hard. Um. Usually I have a cop out and just say Bob. <laughs> you know what? We're going to call... No, I could call him that. <laughs> I was going to call him Carl, but I think I called somebody Carl before. I'm not sure if I did. Leave a comment down below and let me know. 
for those of you who have watched all of my videos. Did I name a Pokemon Carl yet? If not, I might use that on the next Pokemon. You got you guys can feel free to leave your suggestions down in the comment section below as well, and I will either take the most vo upvoted one, or if I just find one that I really like, I'll just use it and give you a. Uh, whoever you are, a shout out, you know, you never know. But leave your uh, suggestions down below. That would help me out, especially when I'm stuck in a rut like this, anyways. Uh, I don't know what to call him. He's a guy, so we can give him a guy name. That kind of narrows it down for me a little bit. So let's call him Steve. I don't know why. He just looks like a Steve. Something about Steve. He was sent to Bill's PC because we already got six Pokemon technically. Because we got that egg. Speaking of egg, have we gotten any farther along? No. Could be possible, guys. It could be possible. We'll be having that sucker all series long. You never know. Darn! I was standing guard up top when that old coot yelled at me. He startled me. And no much I, I fell down here. I think I'll vent my anger by taking it out on you! I just figured he'd be the most annoying grunt out of them all. His name is Joe. Just J O. Joe. Ja. Do. Ja. Jo. I don't know. He's got a gold duck. That's kind of scary. You know, Aflac was pretty fucking scary. So, this dude's pretty fucking scary. We're gonna switch to Patrick. Come on, Patrick. I wonder if it was out of the limitations of Game Freak to animate the back sprites of the Pokemon. Because I know it was already revolutionary when this game came out when I was a kid that these sprites even moved at all. And everyone was like, oh my god, the sprites move. It's a fucking miracle. You know, and it was only, and it, this one can only be played on the Game Boy Color because the Game Boy Color had the hardware that actually could play this game for some reason. <coughs> Although you could play Pokemon Silver and Gold on the original big brick gray one. Figure that one out. So I guess the animation was just out of its limitations on the original. I don't know. But with that being said, wouldn't you think that they have just a little bit more space to animate all of the backs? Even if they did it, like, did the cop-out one that they did, that, that, that they did for Pokemon Emerald. Where they just kind of swayed back and forth a little bit, you know? I don't know. Just a little... Penny for your thought. Thinking out loud. All I know is this motherfucker bulky. He's taking a beating. I wonder how good his special defense is, though. Let's see. Because remember, guys, we don't have just the single special stat anymore. It's now split between two. We have a special attack and a special defense. And I'm only explaining this to the people who don't know. I'm sure a lot of you already know. But I'm sure there's a there's that one person out there or two or three that don't. So I just figured I'd explain it. Alright. You're getting too uh, comfortable over there, gold duck. Go ahead and use that recover. I bet the freaking trainer is pissed right now. It's like, damn it, I was so close. And you fucking had to use recover. <laughs> hey, man, it's just as bad if I use the potion, man. Fuck you. I do what I want. I'm a strong, independent woman. I do whatever I want. Snorlax. All right, all right, okay. You asking for it. Brandy! Brandy! I need you to be handy. I don't know. I thought that'd be funny. Probably wasn't. There we go. Now we can move these around. Bam, bam. Let's try our new move. Karate chop. <laughs> we can one hit KO a Snorlax. That is freaking awesome. I mean, we did it in the last episode too, I think, if I'm not mistaken. With that being said, it don't matter. It's just amazing. Let's see if the, is, is there an item here? No? 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 Okay. I just thought there was an item there. A little hidden item. What you got? Goldine, you suck. Get out of here. Nobody likes you. At least I don't. 
You're like one of my least favorite water type Pokemon. Period. Just I don't like your design. I like Sea. Eh, I don't even like Sea King that much either. But I'd rather have Sea King over a Golding. Can I can I sneak past this this Rocket Grunt chick thingy? Oh, there's an Ivysaur here. There are wild Ivysaurs down here. What the fuck? I would have killed to have that. I'm gonna. Have, I'm sorry. I need. The, I'm gonna. I want the experience. <laughs> and I figured. I didn't know I was gonna get the crit though, but it's still nice. And I thought that was. Oh, I, was, I thought I was gonna level up. Oh, I can't get past you. God damn it! Thank you, Game Freak, for screwing me. Stop taking tails. Yeah, just try to defeat all of us. Oh wait, you're a chick, aren't you? I sort of done a chick voice. I don't even know why I did that. Yeah, you're a female. I'm so sorry. Oh, and and Tanya and again. I don't know how to say that. And Tony and Tony and Tanya and and Tanya and Tony yet. And Toynette? And Ton and Ton and Tonyet. I don't I don't know. I'll be here all day trying to pronounce that shit. Okay. Way to fucking scare me, yo. You got a Tyranitar. That's like dope, but no, no, no. That is a pseudo legendary. I don't give a shit if it's level 9 or not. I am not going to take no chance with this bitch. But it is, if I'm not mistaken, a ground or a rock type. So Bubble Beam should definitely kill it. If not in one hit, a close. Okay. Alright, that's cool. Apparently it's weak as shit at level 9. <laughs> Karama's level 15, sweet. Needle Queen. Oh, we're definitely staying in for this. Shit, this fucking Rocket Grunt's been at work. Especially to train up a Tyranitar or a Larvatar all the way to level 6 and got it evolved to a Tyranitar. I don't know how the hell you did it. And has a Needle Queen, which I can understand that being. Well, no. Actually, you have to get it to level 16 at least, I think. It's like level 16 or 18 or 22. It's one of those three. And then, once it gets to a neat arena, you use Immune Stone, automatic Needle Queen. Damn, son, where'd you find this? You rotten brat. Well, you're a rotten bitch. I don't even know what you're talking about. Give me that Master Ball, please. Pokey Doll. Okay. Alright, I don't want that. At all. It's not useful. I don't even think I can put it in my room. <gasps> Wild Vaporeons too. Come on. And we caught a Graveler of all things. I mean, Graveler is a great Pokemon, don't get me wrong. It's just, come on. I'd rather have the Vaporeon. I'd rather have the Ivysaur, to be honest. At least that's a Grass type. That's something we don't have. I mean, we have... Reaper, who's a bug type, but that don't count. That's not a grass type. It doesn't count. But we are going to switch Karama and Dobbs. Dobbs has been neglected as far as getting that experience. Ooh, I did not mean to do that. Just in case. Let's continue on. Hello, all this. Okay, never mind. I was going to say, hello, Slowpokes. Quit taking Slowpoke tails. If we obeyed you, Team Rocket rap would be ruined. Bro, didn't I just get told that you guys disbanded three years ago? Isn't your reputation like shit already? Which, by the way, that was me. I'm the one that made them disband. Ha, 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 ha. And why do you got a muck? Why do you got to be a douchebag? He's got too much defense, I believe. I take that back. But now he's got better defense. Apparently he had a crappy defense. That works for me. He still ain't gonna survive this quick attack. Which I don't know how doing a quick attack on a giant mount of toxins or whatever the hell, sludge, I guess is what he is. I don't fucking know. Ooh, he's got a pigeon. Hmm. Too bad we don't have our new Graveler. 
Where's Striker when I need him? Apparently, Sand Attack has like lower accuracy or something because it's just, like every time that somebody uses Sand Attack, it misses. Oh, so close. Okay. But he's Crobat. Uh... What should I do? We're gonna. Should we switch? Who are we gonna switch to? Fuck it, we're gonna switch to Reaper on this one. I mean, Dobbs could level up, but Reaper needs to as well. He better level up after this attack. Or after this, uh. After this fight, anyways. Now we have a problem. Now we have a slight problem. Our defense is really down. We just used supersonic, which is going to make it even worse when we hit ourselves. Please don't hit yourself, Reaper. You son of a bitch! Oh, yeah. This is... Oh, fuck. We're in trouble. Oh, okay. That barely did anything. But yeah, we're we're uh, we're gonna switch. We're gonna switch back to Dobbs. Reaper may not level up in this fight, but you'll get a little bit out of the uh, out of his presence being there, anyways. Dobbs, I need you to take care of this, like yesterday. Always coming through, Dobbs. Thank you. It's my boy. He's a ferret. Just so strong. Uh, I think we'll be okay. I think we're Gucci. What's up, Slowpoke? A Slowpoke with its tail cut off. Huh? It has mail. Read it. Let's read the mail. Be good and look after the house with Grandpa and Slowpoke. Love, Dad. Okay, then. Does this one have a note on it, too? No, it's a Slowpoke with its tail cut off. And this is supposed to be a children's game. Let's cut off all the... All the, uh... Tails. That's just... That's... Great and family-friendly. We're gonna switch Reaper to the top. Fight this last grunt, because I think that's all we had to do. What do you want? If you interrupt our work, don't expect any mercy. Chin Chow. Aww. Look how cute the Chin Chow is. I'm not even sure. Oh, wait, never mind. I think I know what it's based on. I forgot. I think it's called the Anglerfish, if I'm not mistaken. It's got a little, like, antenna with a little light bulb, basically, on the end of it. And it's in the very, very, very deep, 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 deep sea. And it's very dark. So all the little fish that see that little light go toward the little light, and then it just fucking <coughs> eats them. It's kind of a dick move, but kind of a cool one at that. <laughs> Why did I use Pursuit? That was a stupid idea. Yay, we're fucking confused again. Stop it. Bad. Chen Chow. We're gonna switch. We're gonna switch. Who are we gonna switch to? Randy. We're gonna switch to Randy. That's who we're gonna switch to. Flail. That's not gonna do shit. But this will. Oh, he outspeeds me. How does a fish out of water outspeed a humanoid Pokemon? I'll never know. Screw it. One more karate chop won't hurt, right? Other than it. Ah! You done. You done, son.
You did okay today, but wait till next time. Whatever you say, buddy. Yeah, Team Rocket was broken up three years ago. But we continue our activities underground. Now you can have fun watching us stir up trouble. And make it double. Oh, wait, sorry. I forgot where I was for a second. <laughs> Way to go, Erika! Team Rocket was taking off. My back's better, too. Let's get out of here. Oh, yeah, uh-huh. I bet your back is better now. Mm -hmm. I bet it wasn't even fucking hurting to begin with. You were just a little bitch and didn't want to fight him and made me, a strong, independent woman, fight him instead. Is that right? I bet. I bet that's how it went. Oh my god! Why do you keep calling me? Hi, Tanya, how are you? This is Liz. I'm fine, but more silly. Huh? Wrong number. I'm oh, sorry. <sighs> I hate this bitch. I hate her. I absolutely hate her. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Whoops. Boop. That's how that gets fixed. Oh my god. I hate that chick so much. And, and I, I think I can't even delete her off of here. A slowpoke my dad gave me came back. Its tail is growing back too. Wait, it grows back? Wait, why am I surprised? It's a Pokemon. Anyway. Hi, Erica! You handled yourself like a real hero at the well. I like your style. I would be honored to make balls for a trainer like you. This is all I have now, but take it. It's a lure ball. Hooray! Too bad it's not programmed right. I don't think it is anyways. I make balls from apricorns. Collect fr them from trees and bring them to me. I'll make balls out of them. You have an apricorn for me? Fine, I'll turn it into a ball. Which application should I use? Hmm, used to. It'll take you a day to make you a ball. Come back for it later. Fine. And then it's not gonna fucking work anyways. And there's some of them that are like, uh, what is it? I think it's the... It's like the gender ball or something like that. It's whatever ball that catches Pokemon of the opposite sex, but it's programmed to catch Pokemon of the same sex, but it tells you differently in the description. Yeah, that shit. Anyway. Everybody has their Slowpokes back. I'm happy. Hooray. Hello, Slowpoke. Oh. Oh, it's just slow. Ha! <laughs> See what I did there? All right, now, let's check our Pokemon real quick. We're fully healed. Sweet. So we can just go straight into the gym. Woo-wee! What's up? Oh, fuck. Hi, are you challenging the leader? No way! Oh, uh, because I totally came in here to check out, you know, the scenery. Like, oh my god, that's some great bugs. You have a lot of bugs in your building. Maybe you need to call pest control. That's why I came. But you have a Meryl. You don't even have bug types. I have a bug type. I think I'm in the right place. I think you guys aren't. I think y'all need to leave. I think you need to get the fuck out of here. I think you need to be in Cerulean. That's where you're supposed to be. Go ahead. Keep wagging that little tail. Winga, 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 winga. Go ahead. I don't give a shit. Because you're dead. Reaper's up to level 14. And uh, I thought he was going to learn something, but I guess not. That's fine. Got a hop hip. At least that's a grass type. You're, you're on the right track. You're on the right track. But it's not quite a bug type. I don't think it is anyways. It's not going to matter. I'm going to have to light his freaking ass on fire. Bye, Felicia. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, too bad that's the last sip of my Dr. Pepper, though. But we're almost to the end of the episode. It's okay. We're going to fight Buggy or whatever the hell this person's name is. I cannot remember the name of the gym leader. But that's fine. Oh, double goodness. Are you trying to be, like, slick? 
Mind you, this game was made in the er, er, late 90s, early 2000s. I'm not entirely sure on the actual year. Back when you might aren't killing tough. I'll prove it to you. But yeah, I can't remember when this game came out. To be honest with you guys, so the lingo and all the little jokes and stuff are going to be so 90s. <laughs> see you, see you, see you. Let's see if you can seal this coming. Oh, fuck. I meant to do quick attack. Whoops. That's probably going to hurt. That's nah, not going to hurt. <laughs> ah, I dropped my controller. Way to go, DC. They should have like, built grips on these things. Slips out your hand too easily. And then I have to get down on my knee. See, Poet didn't even know it. You would think that would do more damage with that little spike sticking out of the freaking forehead of his. Uh, I think Pursuit would be more than enough to kill him. I was going to get so mad if it didn't. <laughs> I'm like, of course! Of course! Marowak? Alright, that's an easy kill. Hey, Patrick! <laughs> My name's Patrick, and I'm a star. And he blows bubbles. There's just so many, so many similarities. I love it. I freaking love it. I'm surprised they haven't made a sponge Pokemon yet. I can name SpongeBob. That'd be great. If there is a sponge Pokemon, I'm surprised I haven't heard of it. Man, that little kid right there was freaking twitching out right there for a second. Look at him. Look at him. He's, I don't know which way I want to look. I don't know which way I want to look. I look this way. Everything's good. But I feel like... Somebody's behind me. Uh, where? Huh? What? Huh? I don't know. Huh? I know there's somebody here. Somebody somewhere around here. I don't know. Where? Uh, I don't know. I'm just making fun of this person standing right in front of me, just twitching all in every different direction. All right. Should I... We're going to put Patrick up front. I don't know why. Just something tells me I should do that. And screw you, kid. But Pokemon evolve young, so they get stronger that much faster. That just sounded nothing like a little kid. Azmural. 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 You would put a you would put a freaking water type against me. Whatever that voice was, it was probably telling me not to use a water type to start. That's what it was probably saying. I just couldn't hear it clearly, apparently, because now I'm fighting a freaking Azmural. Thankfully, they're freaking junk in this generation, I believe. It's not until the later gens when it actually has a better move set and they can actually do more things like, you know, belly drum and then just full on attacking, basically. I think that's the move set that it was recommended for Gen 2. It's basically belly drum and uh, I don't know if it can do moonlight or whatever that health regeneration move is. But that'd probably be the best way to go. That, that, and something else. I know Aqua Jet is highly recommended in the later gens, but in this gen, there is no Aqua Jet. I think that said Butterfree, if I'm not mistaken. I was not even paying attention. Yep, Butterfree. We're going to burn the wings off. You're not going to be so free when I'm done with you. You're going to be melted butter. Oh, that's a terrible joke. Terrible, terrible, terrible joke. Oh, you got a Flareon. The jealousy has risen past ten. 
I just want Evolution, guys. If you haven't noticed, I just want a Jolteon or an Umbreon. Umbreon is a great support Pokemon. Jolteon is a great offensive Pokemon. Just give me one of those two. Tackle. I'm not gonna waste a bubble beam on you. Oh! I should have wasted the bubble beam. What a douche nugget. Rap is been. You're done, son. 508 experience points. Holy shit. Noel. Just evolving isn't enough. N no, no, it ain't. Sometimes it's actually worse. There's our bugified bastard. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Mm, you know what? We'll stay with Patrick. Better not use a water type. That's all I'm saying. Bug Z. Oh, it's with the S. It's not buggy, it's Bug Z. Ah. Oh. I was close though, at least I was close. Anyways, I'm Bugsy. I never lose when it comes to bug Pokemon. Bzz. My research is going to make me the authority on bug Pokemon. Bzz. Let me demonstrate what I've learned from my studies. Bzz. Wow, you are really green, bro. Leader, Marcel Marcellus. I think that's how you said that. Marcellus? Marcel Marcel yeah, Marcellus. His name is Bugsy, though. He's got a lantern. Why would... Okay. Why would you do this to me? Like, are all the bug Pokemon randomized into water types? How did that not affect me? What is going on? Why are half of these work moves that work? Okay, never mind. I should have shut the fuck up. I should have not jinxed myself. But that's okay. We'll just keep using Quick Attack. It's not like you're going to stop me from not going first anyways. No. Bad fish. Bad fishy. You don't fucking do that. Don't do it again. Damn it. That's fine. It's cool. It's good. I thought ahead apparently. Thank you. Thanks, Dobbs. And thank whatever brain cell thought to put that freaking berry on him. Because that was smart. Oh, okay, never mind. It wasn't that smart anymore. Now I done lost my freaking berry. And now I'm probably going to smack myself in the face. What did I just say? All right, <laughs> that's all I needed to know. That Dobbs was not the right choice. Or to go with, uh, no we're not. We're gonna go with Randy. Come on, Muscle Man Randy Savage. The fourth, sorry, forgot about the fourth part. All right. We're going to start things off with a focus energy. I'm going to sweep this whole team with just Randy. Watch. Or not. I might not even be able to. All right. We got to go first. We have to go first. We have to. Fuck! We should be able to eat that up, though. We should be able to eat that up. Yeah. Bye-bye. <laughs> You're done. Who's next? Weed, oh my god, really? Yeah, we're gonna stay in. We're definitely staying in for this. At least he's got a bug type on his team. At least he's got a bug on his team. Like, I can't even complain. I can't even bitch. We're gonna kick it though. <laughs> Ooh, that's not gonna do very good. That's not gonna be good. Karate chop? I mean, I know it's a fighting move. It's not going to be very effective, but how much... Okay, it does more damage, at least. A slight... Slightly. Son of a bitch! We're switching. 
Randy got wounded. He's got to go. <laughs> Sorry, Randy. Now let's go, Karamba. Let's fucking light this bitch on fire. Because now I'm a little irritated. Motherfucker! Twice! Twice in a row? This little fucking bug. Weakest of the weakest bugs is fucking with me right now. Fucking with me. Get out of here. <laughs> I can't believe that shit. And he's got a nine tails on his team, too. What the hell? Alright, Patrick. There's only enough room for one nine tails or one Karama. Okay, I was about to say. Oh, and it's a crit too? Okay. No complaints. None. Patrick's level 16. It's not going to learn a new move, apparently. Whoa, amazing! You're an expert on Pokemon! My research isn't complete yet. Okay, you win. Take this badge. Bitch, I was going to take it whether I lost or won. Got the Hive badge. That's two badges in a row, guys. And, best part is, we haven't even lost a Mon yet. We're doing damn good. If you have it, Pokemon up to... I didn't read the rest of that. Will obey you, even traded ones. Pokemon that no cut will be able to use it outside of battle, too. Here, I also want you to have this. TM49, what you got? What is it? I think it's Fury Cutter. In if I played it normally, so let's see if it's actually going to be that this time. Nope, he gave me something far more useless. He gave me splash. Fuck you, Bugsy. Isn't it great? No, it sucks. I discovered it! No. Actually, you didn't. As a matter of fact... It's been around forever! M Magic Harps. Know it. And... You, <laughs> you could not have given me more of a useless TM. You, you should have just not given me one at all. Oh, I hate you, Bugsy. Oh, shit. We're still poisoned. We are still poisoned. Thank God I have antidotes. Thank God I have antidotes. Poison is cured. Poison is cured. There. All right. Now. <coughs> I know this video is probably going to run a little bit over an hour long. I do apologize, guys. Unless that's what, something you want me to do more often, then I'll do it. It's fine. It's not a big deal. The slowpoke have returned and my apprentice hasn't come back from Elix Forest. Where in the world is that lazy guy? Oh, I guess I get cut from him when I go into the forest. Anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, drop it a like. If not, drop me a dislike and tell me in the comment section what I can do to improve my videos. But anyways, uh, what are we going to do in the next video? Oh yeah, we're going to go through Elix Forest. And then head into, I believe, is Goldenrod City. We'll see. Hold on. Hold up. Hold up. Before we end the video completely. Okay. Slowpoke Well. Elix Forest is next. Route 34. And then Goldenrod City. Yep. Okay. So we'll have a chance to get two more Mons in the next episode. And hopefully, one of them's a legendary. That'd be fucking awesome. We've already encountered one so far. But... Then again, even if we did get the encounter, it's going to take a lot of balls to get it. Because it's like the slimmest of slim chances of catching legendaries with fucking Pokeballs. Anyways, guys. Uh, did I even heal? Or did I st stop midway? Okay, we did heal. My bad. I'm, I'm just thinking out loud. Anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, drop me a like on this video. It helps my channel. It helps my video to get noticed more often. And... It will help with people that want to see my videos and like my videos or not. It just depends on your ref preference. I don't fucking know. I'm just rambling. But, uh, what was I going to say next? 
Oh yeah, if you are new here, go ahead and subscribe to my channel, hit that little bell and you'll be notified for future videos. I upload very randomly, so I'm not really on a set schedule. But if you follow me on Twitter, which link is in the, in the description, you can follow me there and you'll be updated when I do upload or when I'm going to upload or what's going on in the background. It's the best way to get in touch with me outside of YouTube besides the comment section below. Also, um, let's see. What is your favorite vari different variation of the Pokeballs besides the Pokeball, Great Ball, Ultra Ball, Master Ball? Like the lure ball. Oh, it's shit. It's daylight. What's up, daylight? Anyways, what's your favorite Pokeball, basically? Like lure ball, net ball, dusk ball, stuff like that. That is the question of the day. Leave your answers down in the comment section below. Um, Let's see. Like, subscribe, comment, Twitter. I think that's everything, right? I think so. But thanks again, guys, for tuning in and watching all the way to the very end. Hopefully I see you on the next video and thank you for all of the support that I've been getting from you guys lately. It's been like it's been overwhelming. I like I love it. Like I can't believe it <laughs> at the same time. But with all that being said, I hope to see you on the next video for episode I dropped my controller again. I dropped my controller again. God damn it. God damn it. There we go. Okay. Anyways, Oh, see you guys on the next video for episode six, I believe. This is episode six. Or are we on five? I don't know. Whatever episode we're on next. Hope to see you there. Deuces.